Hello everyone. Here in this video, I will tell you about master course in surfacing, which is available in Unigraphics and Catia. I will tell you the different content available in this course and how this content and the examples related to uh, industry oriented. So you already have seen there are lots of application I have written over there like the patch creation, creating the headliner, master section, A to B, clause volume, making the concept, updating the model. So everything about the surfacing you can learn from Unigraphics or for the CATIA software from this course. So here in the first module if you learn about here almost every command related to surfacing you will learn the behavior of command will know about all the parameters available in the command this will develop a strong foundation of surfacing and will give you a confidence and remove your fear related to surfacing task now the second module is the task of applying your fundamental skills or the foundation you have developed during the module one have a application on various projects so here like a five exercises are given to you and two solutions are provided the rest will you do at your own and even the five is available for your practice the third module which is related to wireframe surfacing and model creation here you will learn about uh, creating points lines circle curves without creating the sketch you will going to learn about making surfaces from the wireframes elements and then finally making the solids out of them and there is no use of sketches so the module for there is one more design task which is uh, provided to you for the your experience for your hands-on experience on the surfacing so sometimes what happens a small surface or patch of a surface is removed as you seen on the screen itself the, there are many reasons but some common reasons for these to happen is like making offset when we are developing plastic parts so like when we are doing A to B and close volume then these patches are removed sometimes there is bad data which is came to you through IGS format or some neutral format and that's why there are some patches are you will learn how to create these patches and get clear and smooth surface in the last so the next module in which you are going to learn how to create A to B and the close volume which is required when we are creating plastic product design so here you will have a confidence on some surfacing job work you will have the examples from automotive industry and with the solution and with the exercise for your practice as well now in the sixth module you will learn about uh, updating a surface as per the section so the first question is like did you ever work with the master section if not you must try this as surfacing job work we have to follow some predefined section generated by an experienced or a senior engineer here you have to update an existing surface model as per the master section so this is really one an important task you will learn here the next is the seventh module this module generally we are designing parts with uniform thickness but there are some something we have to take care the thickness varies within a single part so there is no uniform thickness and we have to follow that variable thickness as per the master section provided this kind of work is generally done in headliners or overhead system so practicing this will lead you to the advanced level in surfacing now in the eighth module here you have the design task in which you have to create surface patches between two surfaces so what is the importance of this if you are working in a die face creation uh, as a your design profile you will have to work these kind of things every day and this is really important task of creating the surfaces so the next is the creating some concept so new concept styling design here it will allow you to put your creativity and imagination to improve your CAD shape generation you will allow yourself to make free flow surfacing, free form surfacing and creating the really interesting CAD surfaces. This is the 10th module and here you will going to learn about modifying and update the models you have created previously. Here you will learn how you can update and modify a work model which you have created in the 3 or 4th module and how you will uh, update your model let's suppose you have took uh, around one or two hours 
but if i am telling you to update this one you may take around 5 minutes or 10 minutes to update this one so here your updating skill your uh, structuring your history of the cat is really really important so this is all about the surfacing course and you already have seen only first and the second module the first module is the command base you will learn every command second module is the application of that command after that the next eight module is all about the application at different profile of design so this master surfacing course is really really important for everyone who want to be a career in unigraphy or in catia in design field